The first sign of trouble for the EC-121 reconnaissance plane, which had been sent to gather intelligence off the North Korean coast, was when two MiG-21 fish beds suddenly took off from a North Korean base to intercept the unarmed aircraft. As one of the MiGs flew a defensive patrol around the EC-121, the second went in for the attack. It's unclear if the crew of the EC-121, which was flying outside of North Korean airspace, ever realized what was about to happen. A few minutes later, the aircraft disappeared from American radars. The American base commander sent two Convair F-106 Delta darts to protect the plane, but it was already too late. The next day, the aircraft's debris was found in the water along with two bodies. All 31 crew members died in the attack, making it the single largest loss of life for American air crewmen during the entire Cold War. It's still unclear exactly why North Korea chose to shoot down the unarmed reconnaissance plane.